Welcome to the NPTEL MOOCs course on the foundation for virtual and augmented reality systems. I am Dr. Samit Bhattacharya. I will be the course instructor for this course and I am a faculty member in the Department of Computer Science and Engineering, IIT Guwahati. So, in this video we are going to quickly go through the topics that we are going to cover in the course and overall learning objective. Now, in this course we are going to learn the foundation of augmented reality and virtual reality systems. So, essentially these terms augmented reality or virtual reality, they are part of a broader family of systems called extended reality or XR systems. These are among the key emerging technology areas of our time. There are many other technology areas you are aware of out of which this is one of the key and most promising technology area, one of the most promising technology areas of our time. In this course, we shall learn about the overall idea of these technology areas namely augmented reality and virtual reality and also uh, the broader term extended reality and our focus will be on learning the foundational aspects of the technology area that is the foundational aspects that supports this technology which includes allied domains or disciplines of study such as interactive system development, human factors, computer graphics and so on. Also the hardware and the software systems that are used to uh, develop such systems and the overall objective would be to get an understanding of how to build such systems primarily from the point of view of application development that is software development. So, that will be the overall objective. Now, why we need to learn these things, these foundational aspects? Such technologies as I have already said are among the key emerging technologies of our times and such technologies, extended reality technologies including augmented reality, virtual reality and also mixed reality are going to have huge potential in terms of market value, the commercial potential research funding. So, lot of new research fundings uh, are coming up to uh, build newer and newer more interactive, more intelligent, smarter such systems with better user experience. And both of these points to the fact that we require skilled manpower to work with these technologies to build new systems utilizing these technologies. So, overall due to the requirement of uh, manpower which stems from the fact that such technologies are going to capture a good amount of market capital, it has a good market potential as well as the research funding opportunities points to the fact that we require to know these technologies. In particular, we need to build a base on the foundational aspects of these technologies. So, what we are going to learn in this course? We are going to talk about the basic idea, what it is, what is this technology area and then we are going to talk about the hardware and software that are used to develop such systems. One important thing we are going to discuss is the human factors that influence the experience that is the extended reality experience and how it affects the overall idea of building such systems. We are also going to talk about building such systems, system development. In a structured way we are going to talk about how to build such systems particularly the software systems and last but not the least we are also going to touch upon an important issue in the building of such systems that is optimization concerns where we are going to talk about two types of optimization. One is experience optimization and other one is resource optimization. Now, the course is of 12 weeks duration and uh, the flow is designed in this way. In the first two weeks, first and second week, we are going to cover the introductory concepts including the basic idea of the technology, application domains, some definitions, historical evolution and issues and challenges for the developers of this technology including an important issue of cyber sickness. In the third and fourth week, we are going to talk about the hardware and software used to build such systems. Fifth and sixth week will be devoted to a discussion on the human factors influencing the AR and VR systems. From seventh to ninth week, 
we are going to talk about in details the system development aspects, how to build such systems, what are the stages to follow and how to carry out those stages. Tenth to twelfth weeks will be devoted to a discussion on the optimization aspects. Now, as I said, we will be covering two types of optimization concerns namely optimizing user experience and also optimizing resource requirements. So, both will be taken up in details in these three weeks of discussion including uh, preliminary discussion on the idea of computer graphics and how such knowledge is relevant for understanding these type of systems. In the twelfth week, we are also going to talk about the programming support that a developer can expect while building such systems where we will be trying to marry the concepts learned in the previous weeks to the programming environment support. And we will be taking up this discussion with respect to a specific development platform that is Unity. Also in the twelfth week, we will be concluding the course. One thing to uh, note here is the references. So, there will be no single reference for the whole course. We are not going to follow a single book for the whole course. Instead, we will use books and research papers as references for different parts or topics of the course. So, essentially for different lectures, different topics, we will have different set of references and I will mention the relevant references at the end of each of the lectures. So, this is to be noted that there will be no single reference, there will be multiple references and specific references will be talked about at the end of specific discussion. I hope you will be enjoying the discussions, looking forward to meet you all and uh, as I said this is a very interesting and important topic to master in the current times as it is one of the key emerging areas of technology and there will be huge requirement of manpower. So, learning these topics will help you get assimilated into this development ecosystem. With that, I would like to welcome you all to this course, looking forward to meet you all in the lectures. Thank you and goodbye. Happy learning.